Hello, fellow Trekkers and Trekkies. My name is Robert, or Robbie Booker. I'm from Roanoke, Virginia. Um, please excuse my appearance. Uh, I'm just now getting gray hairs for some reason in my early 40s, and they're starting to sprout up everywhere. So, yeah, excuse my appearance. But um, I'm here to talk about uh, a spoiler-free preview or review, review not preview <laughs> of Constar the motion picture um, uh, I just want to say thank you to Vance uh, Owen or the V-Man is what I call him I've known him for a few years now and uh, he's a good dude good solid dude and uh, I just wanted to thank him real quick for uh, allowing me to see the film before uh, it was actually um put together uh and finalized so i got to see the rough rough cut and uh this is my review um of some of the things i like and dislike about the movie uh let's go over some of the things that i like first um i thought the acting was great on everyone's end um i, I tend to like slow paced acting so like uh getting into the story by listening to people talk um I was able to keep up with, with what was going on for the most part. I do need to go back and watch some things that happened before because I'm not uh, 100% knowledgeable about the the, uh, the events in the universe. But I do think that the acting was great and I really like the story and the plot. Um, uh I thought Royce did a good job acting, uh, even though he's a child, you know, sometimes children can be high energy, so I know it was probably hard to get him to do a calm scene, but that works with his character, you know, trying to be um, someone who's who's excited to go into Starfleet, and um, so the very first scene of the movie um, uh, was awesome, it was excellent, and uh, it had me, you know, interested in what was going to happen from the start um i don't want to get you know it's hard for me to do reviews without giving away spoilers so this is my very first video review ever so um i just want to say uh what else can i say about the movie without giving anything away um i thought the pacing was good uh, the, I thought the director did a good job with the with the pacing of the movie, and he did a good job directing. Um, I can't wait to hear the the music score, uh, but I can hear it in my head as I was watching. Um, so I, I I imagine it's going to be awesome. Uh, all the visuals were good. I, I mean, for a fan fiction, they were really good, and I, I give props to the uh, the uh, people who did that. Um, uh, the production uh, cast or prop cast or you know the digital animators they all did such a good job whoever built the sets uh, you guys did an amazing job it looked I mean it looked authentic authentic and um, it, it was just really impressive uh, so so I talked about some of the acting some of the some of the uh, production. Uh, some of the uh, props. Um, I thought everybody did a really good job acting. I did especially like the Klingon uh, guy when he gave you the uh, the House of Garoth, I think is what it was called. Excuse me if I got that wrong. Um, but I thought he was, a, I thought, I mean, I really liked him as an actor. He's, I think him, Vance, Royce, and... Uh, the one lady with the short brown hair, I can't remember what her act, what her name was in the movie, but I thought she was a really good actress. And, uh, you know, everybody was, was um, you could really see the expression, you know, what was going on while they were in their scenes. Um, I mean, I, I want to know more about the Phantom War. Um, uh, what else? I mean, that's, you know, without giving much away, that's all I really can say because uh, I don't want to give the story away. I don't want to give anything crazy um, away. But I will say uh, I can't wait to see the actual final production because I will watch it definitely. 
Um, and as right now, I, I want to rate the movie 8 out of 10. Some of the things I didn't like, um, I thought some of the scenes were a little bit too long. Um, I mean, I can't really, I can't really judge much more than that, because uh, there wasn't much I didn't like about the film. I know how, I know how fan films work. You know, you, you don't have Hollywood production value, so you get, you're doing the best you can, and the best you can comes out really good. I, I mean, all the uniforms looked awesome. Um, oh, I have to like, like I said, watch from the beginning of the Constar, Constar stuff, but Constar the motion picture. Uh, for a Star Trek fan, you know, who, who enjoys, you know, casual Star Trek, you know, I don't know, I'm not like a, like a encyclopedia on Star Trek or nothing, but I, I you know, I know a lot about TNG and Voyager, because those were my, were my jams uh, growing up, uh, and I like the movies and everything, but um, I, can't, I couldn't, like, actively tell you something in Star Trek, uh, and then go deeply into it without uh, seeing it recently, or, like, trying really hard to remember it because I do have like a memory issue um, but uh, for force from so far from what I've seen Vance guys you all did a great job uh, I applaud you and I can't wait to see the actual finished project all right so uh, I hope you guys like my review and uh, uh, be sure to uh, like and subscribe if you like my my video um, I do other stuff, like uh, I, sometimes I stream games, you know, live stream games, or, you know, I like to draw, sometimes I like to live stream drawing, or whatever, um, and I'm just a, you know, pretty much a casual guy, I don't really try to get too much fan, fandom or anything, you know, if you like my stuff, cool, if not, you know, you get, there's millions of other things on, on Facebook, so, or YouTube, or wherever, um, but again, thanks for watching, and, uh, I'll see you guys out there. Um, live long and prosper. Peace.